Hey again, GT here from GT Garage. Just a short one. Um, exciting times. I received my uh, hitch adapter from McHitch. Now, currently on my trailer, I'm running the Polyblock Treg, I believe. Now, I just accidentally came across uh, the McHitch range when I was watching, I think it was Dash, one of the other four drive channels, and he was testing out the latest McHitch one where it's a auto couple, auto coupler or something. Anyway, I was just looking through their range and I came across this one. Now, I don't have the uni joint one. I have the one that adapts. So this point here, this, um, what do you call it? Vertical pin um, connects to the poly block. And then this part here is what's the same. Now, take it out of the box. So I've already had a bit of a play around with it here. Okay. I do have a tripod, but I just couldn't be bothered with it at the moment. So it's a bit of a struggle with this. So here we go. It goes. That pin is a safety pin. Try not put a dent in my dinner table here. Now, this is safety catch. Now, what happens is you put a few threads into the into the top of it of the uh, what they call it the pin tool. I don't know what it's called. Sorry. Okay, so that's released now. Places your tow bar or tow ball. Okay, now when that slides up into here, that pin is basically what keeps it locked in. And then, and the easiest way was to um, put the pin tool in there, put the locking pin in and then put a few screws into that. It basically just engages the thread that goes through the middle of the pin tool. Okay. And then this pin here, that's where the poly block goes, basically in this section. And then instead of having to fiddle around with the poly block and get it to align, you only need to lower the hitch To the pin tool. Pin. There you go. Um, yeah, wasn't prepared to spend the, um, the money on the, what is it? The DO35, I think it's called. Or the latest, and I don't know if it's the greatest, but allegedly or apparently the greatest. Quite expensive. This was like $90. And it's like take two minutes to fit on there so yeah another little upgrade the kitch trailer adapter i believe that's what it's called 90 odd dollars and like look there's nothing wrong with the um with the uh um, poly block. I find it easy. I read a lot of people complaining about it being a pain. I live on a hill and I can engage it in a couple of minutes and it's no big deal. Um, I mean, yeah, if not for this being $90, I wouldn't buy it. But yeah, I can already see that it'd make it life even that little bit easier without having to spend $400, $500. So, yeah. Like, subscribe, and ask any questions if you've got any.